Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on a set of Corsa uh, Deals Gap, aka Tales of Dragon, to do a stay in your lane drift challenge with this S13. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all found in the description box below. So we do have a new wheel cam going on. We have a Razer here, 60 FPS wheel cam. So hopefully we're going to get some crispier, you know, wheel cam footage for you guys. So we're going to go full send. If you guys don't know what Stay in Your Lane Challenge is, it is drifting in between the mayo and the mustard where you would if you were actually on the road so i would get pr probably gonna go over the line a bunch this is a very narrow road never tried drifting such a narrow road in one of these challenges so like right there we kind of just already went off the road so this is gonna take some funness to be able to stay Oh, fully on my side of the road. So, definitely a challenging thing. I challenge, I've done this before on a couple different tracks, but never one with such a tight... Yep, we're way over the line there. Mm-hmm. Well, that's one. Never one with such narrow, like, road. So, this is definitely a, a fun challenge to stay on this side of the road. And drift all the fun corners. Got the pedal cam and everything back for you guys as well. This is going to be quite the challenge. Because there's not much room for error. Putting this CS or RS V2 wheel through its paces. There's a lot of corners that we can't, a lot of straights that we're not going to be able to drift on. Oh, don't go in the dirt. Nope. Already in the dirt. I mean, that's one issue there. But we're going to see what we can do fully. This is an extremely tough road to do this on. As you can see, there's not much room for this car to fit. To keep it in between the mayo and the mustard. That was a tire drop there. Going to be using it, lizing a lot of left foot brake. Oh, stalled the car out. Should have clutch kicked. And a lot of handbrake to keep the car kind of an angle through this. Oh, dirt. We did cross over on that because we had to come out of the dirt. So the inner corners are a little easier because we can kind of drop our tire in the, the front tire in the dirt. Not so much back there like that. That can get super sketchy. I mean, my back bumper's over the line, but you know. So if there was an oncoming car, we would have definitely collided. Oh, we dropping dirt. Oh, we got it. We dropped the front tire there. Oh, we're way over the line there. Yep. Front tire is definitely over that line. This, I don't think this road is even wide enough for... <laughs> One car to be going sideways. I mean, sideways is not much angle, but... So, I won't talk about a, a challenge. We need like a small little, like, be on a forest rear wheel drive or something super narrow. To stay fully on the side of the road. Nope. Cut over two. I've lost count. Definitely way over the line that one. This is, this is hard. 
Yep, that one too. So if you guys have this track, I challenge you to try and do this. I feel like I want to bring a bunch of different cars and try this. Some other street cars, maybe some pro cars. Stay in your lane challenge is something I've done a few times before. Like I said, but never on such a small, narrow road. Yep, we're over there. I don't think it's... Honestly, it may not be totally possible to do this. We, like I said, we probably need a really short wheelbase car. We're not doing too, too bad. Given... We are just going full send, too. We're not trying to be very cautious. Oh. That third chop screwed us up! And I got my hands all twisted. Oh, we're way over the line there. I mean... Full blown out drifting this course is super easy and super nice. We're trying to stay on this side of the road. Not so easy. Oh, jeez. Ah, that little road. That part has a bit of a... An offshoot that we could have utilized. Just belching fire. <laughs> Ooh, that was pretty, pretty good, but we were definitely over the line with our bumper. I feel like this car's got such a big bumper on the back end, it's almost impossible not to. Oh, oh boy. I don't know how we saved that. They were definitely over the line there. There's not enough room. Or man didn't try to make the best out of it. Probably less angle we could probably do this, but what fun is that? See, if we do it with less angle like that, we could definitely stay in, but that doesn't look as cool. Oh, jeez. We just went hard break. So we did not fall off the mountain. That would have totally just ended everything off the rip. Third gear. So I do challenge you guys to try and do this. This is a extremely tough course to do a stay in your lane. And if you guys do do one, I would love for you guys to show me the replay either tag me in it on like instagram or whatnot because i'd be very curious to see some people do the entire deals gap in the stay in your lane challenge Ooh. and not cross the line like i said we need a small car because this car is really big when it comes to the size of the bumper and everything. I love S13s, it's probably one of my favorite best chassis of all. I think the road's getting narrower. Is it getting narrower or is it just me?
Nope, it's definitely getting narrower. <laughs> so, <laughs> we managed to make it all the way up. And, uh, we managed to fail the stay in your lane challenge tremendously. So I challenge you guys to take on this challenge as well. We're just gonna, we're just ripping it downhill because why not? We're not trying to stay in the lane. We may do that on another episode, try and do it the opposite way and the opposite lane. So if you guys enjoy this, you guys want to keep seeing here more on a set of courses like this, let me know down in the comment section down below. And as always, I uh, thank you guys for all coming back to another episode here on the channel. I appreciate all the support. If you guys are not subscribed to the channel, I would appreciate it. If you did, tap that subscribe button and uh, hit the like button. It helps me out tremendously in, of course, YouTube algorithms. So as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit! So yeah, we spun out. I'll see you guys on the track.